Welcome to 247techies.com. Prepare for an outstanding experience in tech support. You will now be connected to one of our friendly techies. Your call may be recorded for quality assurance purposes. Please stay on the line for the next available agent. Thank you for calling 2470. This is Helen. I help you. I didn't catch your name. What was that name again? My name is Alan. Alan? Yes. I need some help today, Alan. How can I help you? Well, my damn computer ain't working. Can you repeat that? My computer, my... Damn it, hold on, the kids are making noise. Shut the hell up in there, kids. All right, the, my computer ain't working. The well, I turned it on, and no matter what I type, nothing happens. It's not turning on. Well, it turns on, and then the screen pops up, and but then when I go to type on it, nothing, nothing pops up, and there's no letters or nothing that come up on the the TV screen there. Okay, when did this problem start? No, well, this morning, right after I made made a little coffee and. I was feeling a little down today because it's Thursday and I, I like my weekend, so I put a little whiskey in my coffee and then I went over to the computer room and uh, and he hung up on me. Some bitch. Let's call him back. Welcome to 247techies.com. Prepare for an outstanding experience in tech support. You will now be connected to one of our friendly techies. Your call may be recorded for quality assurance purposes. Please stay on the line for the next available agent. I hope, I hope we get Alan again. Yes, hello. This is Daniel with 24-7 Techies. How can I help you? Oh, da Daniel, I was talking to Alan and something happened. The telephone system went bleep, 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 and it disconnected on us. Um, Give but, a second. Let me see if it's right. available. Hold on. Alan has taken up another customer. What can I assist you with? Well, like I was telling Alan, I was trying to get on the computer this morning, and uh, it turns on and everything, but when you you go to type the, the stuff on the TV screen there, not, nothing's popping up right right now. And uh, since when has this been happening? This morning. I uh, got up this morning and made me some coffee and decided I'd go get on the computer. I haven't been on it in quite some time, and... And so I plugged it all in and turned it on, and it, it it turns on. It goes to that screen there, but then when you go to type something, it, it, nothing types on the screen. Okay, and uh, is your keyboard working properly? Did you check that? Well, how do you ch check it? I don't. I mean, it's plugged in. Everything plugs into the keyboard, so. My my, dis, my my drive it it clickers and clats so I know that's working and everything. Daniel. Yeah, checking all done. All right. They're doing construction. They're doing construction in the apartment next door to me, so don't pay no mind to all that loud ruckus noise going on, Daniel. Understood. No issues. Do you have another computer by any chance? <laughs> I could barely afford this one when I bought it, so yeah, I only got one computer. Okay. Hold on. I tried calling my nephew. That's my my brother's son. And uh, uh, Bobby, he he tried to walk me through everything, and he said he said he said sounds like Uncle, you got everything connected, right? And I said, well, it's been a while, but I thought it was right. But it, it turns on and it comes up to that screen there, and and the blue screen, and then yeah. um, and then nothing. You hit the keyboard and then nothing happens. Nothing happens. No. Okay. Uh, here's what I can do for you. So, the thing is, without another computer, we can't really do much, and we will need to test 
the keyboard out as well to see if there's anything wrong with that. Key. How do I test the keyboard out? I'm plugging it into another computer. That's why I checked if you had another oh. computer. Huh. Uh, hold on, let me see if there's an alternate option. Should I disconnect the tape drive? There could be a way of checking it, but hold on. You, yeah, I think we can't really do much about this. You will have to take this to a local store and check it out, unfortunately. Uh, well, is, is there some place where I can buy some parts for it? It's an old Commodore 64, and it's got the 1541 disk drive and the, the 1352 cassette drive, and and play a lot of games on it. I was hoping to play some games on it today for, you know, lunchtime, but it just, it's not working right, Daniel. So how do I fix it? Right, so you can take that to a local tech support store and you can... Now, Daniel, 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 I don't got, Dan, Daniel, uh, Daniel, Daniel, I don't got time and, and I don't drive anymore. I'm too old. So if you could just help me get my Commodore 64 computer here, work and i can play some some frogger or something after this afternoon when i'm having my afternoon beer like i said there's nothing we can do from our end regarding well, this well, issue so your only option would be to take it to a local tech support store you uh, got that well daniel i did find this this uh floppy disk here and it says uh insert this inside the ben chode how do, what's that about no idea like ben chode mother chode how about mother chub? No idea. Yeah, no I idea. bet you do. You what part of Calcutta are you guys in? Well, oh, he didn't like Calcutta too much, did he now? Dumbass. <laughs>